What's up guys, Barry Gaming, you're back with some more Idle Heroes, and today we are back on pretty much like our account overhaul. Actually, you know what, I can't remember the last, I think we, we've been like three or four episodes in, something like that, uh, but I think we're on episode four for TW here. Now, this is something we have been waiting for because we've been sitting on these B-plus Awakening Stones, and even though this Soul Awakening session... It's only gonna give us a B minus. We're gonna go at least 300 points on this event. Uh, he already looks like he's done a bunch of stuff here. He didn't pick his reward, so we're not gonna touch that. But as you guys can see, we've got 3,700 contract star gems and we have some hero copies. Looks like he might've actually made some purchases in the meantime. Uh, not quite sure. Either way, we are using both of these stones on Lord of Fear Aspen, AKA his Aspen copies because well, we just really, really, really hope we can hit a decent Aspen copy. So let's see what we got here. I think we might have had some chess. Yeah, we got a we got a lot of Aspen copies, and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do all Aspen copies because he just sells the best. Even though he the market gets flooded with Aspen copies all the time, it's just the best thing to do. So let's see. Can we see them easily? Yeah, not too bad. So we have a free awakening and then we have the crystals. So let's start here. Let's see what we can find. Maybe we get lucky with the free one and then we can use them on elsewhere. But of course not. That's not going to happen. So one Aspen down, not going to happen. But we're going to use these. Now, remember, we have like what a 4.065% chance essentially or about about a 4% chance to high roll into an A minus or higher hero copy. So this is the moment we need to see some good things because number one, it's going to give us good progress. And number two might be our giant killer we have been looking for. So fingers crossed. Let's go. Come on. Please show me some red. Oh, it's a B plus. Oh my God, it's so close. A B plus, B plus, A minus, and it's a B plus. So at the very, very least, we have a copy potentially for our tenant. 4,900 actually, I think might be better than this one. Uh, yeah, technically it is. Let's see though, if we high roll into something even more premium, like a giant killer. That was really, really close. Let's make it happen. Come on. Show me red. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. No. <laughs> but that's is about as best as you can hope for for a B plus version. So essentially what we're going to do on this account to retool it a little bit. We're going to give him this copy right here. It's got holy damage, crit damage reduction, which isn't the best. And then what we're going to do with the other one is we are having a tenant copy that's going to get upgraded to this one because it's got the higher attack roll so we do have this b plus um i'm gonna lock it down in case he wants to hold on to it for some reason i don't want to accidentally scrap it but just by doing that alone we're already up to 34 points so not too bad not too bad so let's get going we're gonna keep doing some aspen copy see if we get lucky wait a minute actually we do have one b minus i think the b minus we're gonna use on the isla mock so let's do that just because we don't have an awakening on him at all this will at least get a decent copy like maybe it high rolls too maybe we see some red here no we see purple of course so yeah b minus but we did need an awakening on him period so we got it um close very very close so close and that is the fun of b plus stones it's such a tease because it's like one of the first experiences i feel like most people have seeing a red streak come from the sky but sadly uh yeah not quite what we needed so let's get going we're of course gonna feed off all these copies and recoup our resources <sighs> so close both of them were actually very decent copies the high roll on the a minus attack was nice i will say that much that was pretty nice but not nice enough to be a giant killer that was our hope that that was going to be something that pushed us forward on this account was the giant killer the very least we have a much better attack value on our main lord of fear aspen and the aspen tenant so oh, man i always get like i almost get like an adrenaline rush when i get b plus stones because it's like it could it could high roll it could high roll and then it it, it didn't <laughs> and then it just didn't high roll oh man all right let's keep going let's keep a going see what we can find getting c copies is going to be good sadly 
that's a d plus that's not even a refund you know what those two patricias are looking at me and i kind of want to awaken the patricias but Ooh. oh okay at least it hit b minus at least it hit b minus that's like our little consolation prize so let's get up you know what i think honestly man you know what i kind of need to think about this real quick we're at 100 points this count i think needs cores right because like we're lacking cores yeah so we definitely need cores on this one which means we need to go up to the 300 point mark 600 seems a little much especially for this account so i think that's what we're going to do we'll go for 300 points and then we'll stop when we're done at 300 if tw decides to go for 600 that's on him but again i don't really want to be using those resources if i don't have to i'd rather save these up and continue to get more core of origin chests instead of destiny transition material so all right let's get going what else Ooh, come on come on oh i hate rainbows i hate them i hate it it just like it, especially when the first one's like the highest tier in it like this come on please please don't do it to me again i mean that's almost as bad that's a t plus <laughs> oh man i mean honestly though anything that's d minus or better like if we don't see any e's that would be a high roll holy cow more green it's a b copy too that's gonna be good points and good retirement value unless he wants to sell it but jeez that is some value right there holy man we've gotten a lot with let's say we got that with a b minus and a b so far that weren't part of the original three stones that we did this is looking pretty good to get to 300 points we are actually like probably progressing very quickly because those b's are worth like b minus is what like 17 and then the b plus is no no i think that's a minus is 17 so it's like it's worth 14 and 16 i think that's pretty good though especially when we we're just going a couple hundred up not bad we could hit though a giant killer somewhere around here that would be convenient maybe our first ever s tier copy even now that would be even sweeter come on we can do it we can do it let's get it let's get it no wrong color yellow looks like orange so much when it comes down the only reason why you know it's not actually orange is because it does oh my gosh I'm clicking too early is we're not getting the rainbow explosion right when we do the summoning right here come on mm, i mean like i said purple's fine i'll take purple i wonder if we're actually going to end up with contract star gems left over before we even retire that would be awesome let's check our point total we are at 188 man it feels like it's going slow still i feel like we should be much further along right now mm, i mean like it seems like we're getting a high roll i mean overall we're definitely gonna have a high roll i feel like just because we use awakening stones but like maybe it's just from doing so many during the soul awakening session it just feels like it just feels like we've already done so many across reeves account that it's like oh man even doing 300 feels painful when we're doing it manually maybe that's what it is now that i've gotten used to using the macro this is the tedious part is the actual clicking to do awakenings because it's actually fun doing awakenings like when we're on twitch or youtube live streams and we're just letting the macro go and while we get to enjoy talking to chat and everything that's pretty fun all right let's keep going let's get through these aspen copies and then we'll see where we're at we'll probably retire everything outside of the b minus and b range let's go to more aspen copies and let's go let's go come on please another green okay that's the opposite that is garbage all right so let's retire let's do some smart retirement see how many contracts terror gems we get back it should be pretty good even without touching the bees and the bees are probably worth quite a bit too we started with what 2700 i think even if we just do 
1800 that's pretty good we're still at 1800 and we're at 235 so again not too bad let's grab some more of these chests out get some more aspen copies because again aspen is the hero we want to go for on this account if we can get aspen that would be awesome <laughs> open this chest up got mock man i think we'll just use what we got left now yeah so let's grab some mockman copies out and let's grab some aspen copies out and i think that will finish it for us i think oh my gosh i keep clicking early i apologize you guys are probably getting triggered it just it keeps slowing down instead of the normal swipe pace i'm used to so it's kind of triggered me all right what was that 235 so this is probably like another five points so that puts us at like 240 honestly we might have enough aspens just to finish this out Oh, of course we're going to hit all the E tiers now, though. Good Lord. To the dumpster we go. Oh, no. We've used up all of our luck on his account already. And it wasn't even that good of luck. It was just B minus and B copies. And now, ooh. How, how does this game do this to us? How does that happen? Like, granted, that's a really good hot copy to sell, but like, are you serious, man? Are you, are you freaking, are you kidding me here? 5,600, so technically we could put it here, but honestly, that copy might be better off being sold. I, I thought, I honestly thought we had it. I literally thought we had it right there. I, I thought we finally pulled a giant killer from a natural summon. Oh my goodness, 266. That was the biggest dopamine hit and crash I have ever felt. Oh, especially considering it was a red streak coming from the sky. Like, are you kidding me, DH Games? Why are you doing this to me? Why can't I just pull that? Like, why? I want to do it for my viewers. If I'm on a viewer account, I want them to hit something god dear. I really, really do. Ah. I was like, maybe we'll even see orange on that one. Nope. Double B plus green. So stupid. Come on, man. Ah. I mean, these these C tiers are really good because they're more than a refund. They're 50 extra starry gems. Ah! <laughs> I can't believe how close that was. That is so crazy. There it is, 303. So we'll go through and re retire everything outside of the B range. And uh, yeah, we end up at 1300. But we did get some really good upgrades here. So we got 15700 That was off of B-plus stone. And then we also managed to snag ourselves. Where is it? Uh, this one right here, maybe? No, that's the 4700 copy. The 5695 So that was close. It was really, really close. But sadly, we didn't get there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I'm a little disappointed, but it was still fun. And I'll see you guys next time.